So this is the one we're calling the runty one. Um, its mother has abandoned it. It's I tried to get her to feed it and she wouldn't stay still long enough. Um, so it was coming down to whether or not we let it die or I put it down myself. And then my son thought, why don't we try and save it? Now I don't even know if this is going to work. This is, um, this is cow's milk. But, um, I'm just putting a little drop on its lips. It looks like it wants a drink. I'm just gently, I don't even know if this is right, but I'm gently stroking its lips to try and think it's um, being fed. And it's trying to swallow. Can you see that? It's, it's swallowing there. I'm sure my rabbit books cover this topic. I should have looked, but um, you know, like everything I do, I need to do act quickly. So we warm the milk a little bit, a bit closer to body temperature, and. Um, I'm just feeding it gently with this syringe. It's moving more than it was before. I don't know if you can see, but like that's its stomach. It's pretty much just a hollow cavity. Almost. That's it. Come on. This is the one that's missing an eye, I think. There's its eye in there. Under that hair. So it might be a one-eyed rabbit. I'm trying to close my hand around it so that it stays warm because it was a little bit chilled. Come on, little one. So this is a, um, a wheat pack that Kitty made. So she just warms it up a little bit. And uh, it's just, it's warmer than my hand. So we're going to see if it can stay warmer. Still alive. Doesn't seem to be breathing. 
Can you think? Well, this little guy has died. Um, maybe all the, the trauma of being, you know, fed milk. Maybe the milk wasn't good for it. Um, maybe just, we just did too little too late. Um, maybe it would have died anyway in a couple of minutes. We just gave it a little bit longer life. But, um... <coughs> Yeah, this little guy's dead now, I think. Well, he's dead now. So, we'll give him a little burial. And seeing him, see him off. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's anything we could have done. Maybe if I acted earlier this morning. But he seemed pretty much fine. It could be that being attacked by all our... Um, really badly affected him a lot more than it looked it wasn't just his eye it was actually um, maybe maybe he had a, an infection because it was infected his face was swollen up here maybe um, yeah maybe maybe she bit his skull so yeah, maybe its skull was broken, my son thinks, maybe, uh, or Kitty thinks that by Orla having this little baby in her, in her mouth, it just reeked of Orla, and so the mother rejected it. Um, maybe this was the baby that fell through the, the cage on the first day that I rescued in the morning. And it, um, maybe the mother rejected it at that point for something that we don't know about, maybe there's something wrong with it because it did have a bite on its head from um, from Marilyn. So yeah, so a sad little guy. He lived for maybe five days, but we have to bury him now. Thank you for watching my video. If you'd like to know more, please go to littletazzyprepper.com.